not updating for about a, about three weeks. We finally get back to this. Yep, we're back to Super Mario RPG. And this is going to be take two of this because I died on the boss and it was humiliating. Come on. Let's just let's just do all this. I'm sorry if you missed out on this playthrough. I'm sorry that I didn't get it done. I finally Yep. Well at least one thing's fixed. The equipping item thing isn't gonna freeze anymore. Which is good for us all. Yeah, but we're still gonna have I think recording is gonna call it the flicker. Yeah, what happens is is that if you kind of it, it depends on time but since when I had to redo this part it took me forever to get the third sniff it so I kinda screwed it up so they're both gonna kiss me because they're gay <laughs> they're gay don't admit it they are gay alright well let's go you say Princess Peach the game's over screw saving the world Peach is saved yeah, here comes the cake, people. That cake, I hate that freaking cake. I mean, there are, there are other bosses that are harder than the cake. There's like Yardovich and Johnny Jones, and they're harder than that stupid cake. Of course, it's the final boss, and there's one of the secret bosses. I was originally going to make another video where I was going to show Fighting Booster, but I just said, I'll oh, screw it. And plus, I couldn't do it anyway, because I didn't feel like a... Alright, and also, yeah. My stats are going to be a little bit different. Which you basically have to just hit the cake. The those guys are not gonna do anything because they're do they do like one hit of damage and they're good. Okay. Da 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 da. Yeah, they worked all day on this. You you wouldn't want to kill your cake if you've been working all day on it. Yeah. Bowser has the amulet, so he has like a very high defense count. I think I, I don't think I should have gave in to Bowser anyway. Oh my god, the cake, it is alive! Oh my god! Poke, poke, poke. I already know this dialogue, because I have memorized it. It is not moving, you twit. Yeah, that the one on the left is mostly the French one. The other dad just speaks English. It moved again. <laughs> Oh my god, it moved again! <laughs> this is going to be the most difficult boss ever in the history of bosses. Because the cake is a lie. And you are an idiot, Stimpy. It's not moving. Oh my god, it's moving! The cake's not a lie, it's alive! God, that joke worked better in the previous take. <laughs> So yeah, it's a it has three faces: that demon, demonic one on the bottom, a chain chomp, and then it has a regular face. What you gotta do? You gotta get all of its candles out because this phase is the hardest. And every time it does that attack, it's going those sort of attacks direct to hit attacks. It's going to re no, we're not doing that again. It's gonna relit a candle. So you're gonna want to attack it. It's gonna take a little bit of a little bit of trial and error. Actually, no, it's not. It's gonna take a while. It's all attack hits are not going to do anything. It's mostly those attacks. Great guy, I'm all back. Oh, it didn't. I guess it only works once. I'm I thought it did it. If it does it both times, it does it. Hmm. I guess I'm wrong. I'm doing much better than the last hit because I kept it kept doing the um. See that that's what I hate about the bosses. They do they do random attacks. It kept doing the um. The double attacks the all hit all attack so I kept dying so I got to like six minutes and it like and I died don't reckon beat this guy very fast this boss isn't really that hard anyway yeah I said in there now you just have to hit it one more time and it will see it's like it does like does like these sort of these sort of attacks and when it does these sort of attacks you die like that and I am screwed it only has one candle left only needs two more hits and that phase is dead and then we're good once that phase is dead, we can kill it and be done with everything. Cause this cake's annoying. I hate this cake. Oh, this thing will kill you in one hit. Oh, except if, unless you're Bowser. Unless, unless you're Bowser, of course, it won't do it because Bowser has high defense. Come on, I want this thing dead tonight. Why the hell won't this thing just die? I hate this thing. This thing is really, 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 really annoying. 
It's like one of the most annoying bosses ever. Yeah, well, there's a, we're going to get to more annoying bosses. This is the part I'm going to start dying. No, no sandstorm. Don't do sandstorm. Don't do sandstorm. Don't. Alright, there we go. And we hit it one more time, and that phase is dead. Both. There we go. Yeah, back. Yeah, okay. Now phase is dead. It doesn't do any coins. That rip off. Alright, now what we have to do is just keep hitting this thing, and this boss fight will be over. That's mainly the main part of the fight that's going to take you a little bit is mostly the candle part that's most it because it does like all these it randomly like does like a lot of attacks it's really annoying but once you once you get past that part you're home free okay the organs over there this is the only fight to actually fight in a church you're fighting a wedding cake in a church it's badass that's why this game is awesome you fight a wedding cake in a church because you wanted to stop a wedding and Gino died again and I'm running out of pick-me-ups I better buy pick-me-ups after I finish up this tick I should I really should I got free people doesn't matter this thing will die in like a few. I don't know how much HP this guy has because I never use Mallow okay the boss is over oh I got six minutes and I beat the boss Norm in the first day that's when I died at six minutes this is Booster's wedding cake yeah, I like the humor in this. It's not really fun. This is like one of the funnier ones. After this, they don't really do any more. Wait, I'm wrong. There is another one, like when you get to Nimbus Land, there's like a humor humor thing at the end of the fight. Is a cake. Yeah, booster, you communist. I think he is Russian. He looks like the guy from Santa Claus is Coming to Town. The dude that bans all toys because he tripped over one. And is that, or the stuff that's wearing skirts, he looked like he was wearing a skirt. <laughs> yeah, fun, oh god, did I just skip the dialogue? They say you should boil it. No, it's too messy. You don't boil a cake, you retards. Open wide, alright, we're gonna open wide, open wide now. <laughs> Before a bungee jump. Nah, it doesn't matter if the cake moved, just kill it, I want this cake dead. Smithy infiltrated cake into this wedding, and we want to die. Okay, Nurse Smithy gang member has been killed. No, it's not Smithy gang member. If it was Smithy gang member, we won't see Nurse Smithy gang member until the next chapter. Well, that's sort of, this ain't the end of chapter 4, because we still haven't found the star piece. This is just a little bit of filler. All games need their filler. Every RPG needs at least a little filler. And plus, we had to save Princess Peach anyway, so. Right, and now they're leaving. Yeah, jump over my head, why don't you? Yeah, Mari, and they don't want to jump over Mari because he's Italian. They're racist. Yeah. Alright, level 7. Uh, I want to give you more HP. Alright, well. Knight in Shining Armor. That's right, Elaine. I saved you from being married. Uh, I played too much Secret Monk Island. Okay. Peach has, Peach has joined the party, even though I have never going to use her. And that's not the end of the chapter. See you in part 21 where I take from the speech back to the castle and get the fourth star piece. Bye.